Alrighty, my friends. So this next ship is actually a pack of ships called Keese Type DV7 from Mr. Uh, Keese. Um, and wow. Wow. How many ships is it? Uh, looks like it's all all Type A ships. I might need to unlock the crystal on this to look for uh, the crystal on this. Um... Well, okay then. There are we're, there are a lot of ships we're gonna have to play in this pack eventually. So this will take us a while to get through. <laughs> Let's take a quick teaser to through some of the other ships. Ion drone, mind control, no boarding, artillery thing, ion blast, basic laser. The colors on these ships look pretty amazing. Oh, the cloak ship looks cool. Well, let's just start with the Fireball, the Kestrel A in this ship pack from Mr. Keese here. Uh, Kestrel Cruiser Type D. The captain let their son decide on a new paint job for the hull. It definitely looks, um, yeah. Certainly matches the hasty maneuvers this ship is known for. <laughs> Speed Laser. This modified burst laser sacrifices accuracy for power and speed. Three power, four shots, 10% fire chance. What does it mean by accuracy? Oh, is it a, it's probably an AOE thing is probably what it is. Tail recharge booster, two engines, one shield. Interesting. Look at that paint job. You put flames on the side, it'll go faster. The fireball. All right. Do we have Gibbs for this? Follow the rebellion. Nice. Clean gives, Mr. Keese. Very clean. It's got a clone bay to start. And since I forgot to get Grima last time, let's get Grima here. There you go, Grima. Um, you don't know if pancakes is the right word for what you're describing. Thin pancakes are crepes. Or Norwegian style, Swedish style pancakes. Okay. Follow your heart. All right. Thanks. Uh, who is the one who says that? Um, does Napoleon Dynamite say that? Follow your heart, and all your and all your wildest dreams will come true. That is pretty inaccurate. Like flak tube size, I guess. Might be a little wider than flak tube, potentially. But it is fast and it's three shots. The speed laser. Speed racer. Speed race speed laser. Follow your heart, time to eat more. <laughs> yeah. You wanna be human too, Avi? Alright, I'll get you in a second. Right. Healing. Uh, you can be the weapons human. It's red, so that makes it faster. No, it really makes it faster, these flames that are painted on the side. But everybody knows that blue flames are faster than red flames. Everybody knows that. So we're going to go for a uh, second shield first, for sure. Is it possibly Clone Bay, which renames crew after cloning? Uh, I, I don't know about that. I'm not sure if that's possible or not. The flames are hotter, at least. That's right. Uh, Clone Bay. Yes, that should be safe. Yeah, cool. Four Mort. Mort up there. Um... Two nebula jumps will give me an extra jump. But I can't really get an extra jump. Well, okay. Yeah, I can get this in nine. So if I go here in nine, eight, seven, six. If I get here in six, that should work. Okay. Hopefully this this ship will be our speed run ship. It's made for speed anyway. Speed weapons. Speed oh god, that was a lot of misses. Good dodge. If that hit our shields, that would have been disastrous. Wow. Okay. 
Thank God for dodges, man. Okay, finally there. That's this accuracy is actually a huge downside to this ship. We are not getting hits, man. There we go. There we go. I don't know if I like this weapon or not. The uh, accuracy really is an issue. It really is. It's a cool idea for a weapon. Okay, well, there's our second shield. Beautiful. Bam, bam. 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 We need a halberd. I mean, halberd is nice. Yeah, I'm not properly equipped. So if I'm going through two nebula jumps, um... Seven, six, five. I need to be here in four. So four, three, two, one. So I take all these shots. We need three reloaders with this weapon. Damn it, cloaked ship. Auto ship. Oh man, the bad accuracy is going to be an absolute nightmare for this ship. Dodge there. Oh my god. I'm not going to be able to hit anything on this ship. Two damage frickin' missile, too. This weapon is a nightmare against auto scouts. It'd be an absolute nightmare against auto scouts. Sensors are burning down. I don't think I'll be able to stop it. I mean, no dodges except for the fact that he's going to be able to dodge. How many shots is this? Three or four? It is four shots, though. It's four. Okay, alright. Alright, that could have been worse. That could have been worse. Look at that. He is... Dodgers are nice, you say, as we get hit by two missiles? Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Be hero. Oh, man. These skinny room ships are the bane of my existence here. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know if I can approve of this inaccurate weapon. I'm going... That's a, that's a lot of fuel. I'm going to take that deal because it's going to take us forever to kill him with our inaccurate laser here. Still have not seen a store. Let me get one power. All right, now we're saving for a weapon swap out or hacking, I guess. Here he comes. Here comes Speed Laser. <laughs> Speed Laser. Still outnumbers the three missiles we dodged, huh? Wow. Our missing on piloting took out his weapons. Beautiful. Have to take a quick break. We'll be back in 20 minutes. Alright, we'll be here. I'll be here, Grima. So will your body on our ship. Nice double reward, man. Beautiful. So if my store's down here. Oh, what I want to go to it. Do I have any augments to sell? I do. Hmm. Do I miss out on a jump if I go down here? But I think I'm guaranteed to see a store, because I don't think I've seen one. All right, I'm going to miss out on one one jump to check for store here. Time for supper for you, Avi. All right. You cannot do damage to us. So I'm going to try to not shoot your weapons. You got bored of me. Beetle do, beetle day. All right. Well, this is the only good room to aim at, so I guess I'll do that. I want to get some dodge training, but 
No weapons allowed, I guess, since it's the only big room. Should have put your shields in there, sir. Wow, those dodges, though. Although I probably shouldn't be talking about enemy dodges. It's more about our weapon going around their ship. Called it, man. Called the store. Alright, one, two, three. I'm hoping... What am I even hoping for? I don't even know. Nothing that's here. Do I sell my FTL recharge booster to get anything? To get an NG for blue options? Eh, I would rather save my scrap for weapons over hacking. So, crappy stores, crappy. Sweet sector store, one sort's always happening, uh, hiding. Although it was kind of a not so sweet store there. Is there any fire chance on this? There it is, 10%. Well, here's where this ship should be quite strong. Get through Zelda Shield Sector 1 quickly. Hopefully. I don't know. Two for me. Do, do, do. Okay. Didn't bomb my shields or weapons. One more volley should do it. Nice double reward. Okay. All right. Good sector one, except for a crappy store. But good scrap gains. Level two shields. We have enough for a weapon swap out or hacking. We sell our augment. So we have the FTL recharge booster. Oh, this could be a free NG. Oh, yeah, buddy. Not quite a silly device yet. But... <clears throat> That's one of my favorite pickups. Sector 1 is a free NG. Wow, rock or rock. Such wow much choice. Goodness. Clone Lady does protect us from rock live mine at least. So I don't need to invest in the huge amounts of engines or anything like that. Yay for rocks. I mean the music rocks if only Inan were here to say it. Stress beacon, no thanks. Solar flare. Okay, he can't damage us except by solar flareage. Could you miss into the shields, please, lasers? Can you... Inaccurately hit accurately something I want. Perfect. Okay, not a bad fight. Took a little bit of health damage on you. Still no store. Can't get that if that's our store now. Lots of distress beacons, this rock sector. I have lots of fuel. 22 scrap for 3 fuel, that's a great deal. Alright, there's our store. So do I greed for more? How many jumps do I have? 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. Now nah, let's go ahead and hit it. Let's see what we got. If there's like a flak heavy, I would absolutely swap this out. Backup battery, hacking, long range scanners. Whoo, this store's got... Some juicy things in it. Um, so, first things first, check if there's another store, just in case. Gotta always check that, okay. We always do this. I am too scrap short of getting both backup battery and long range scanners. So let's get the long range scanners. Decent weapons, I wonder if maybe getting one of those is better, but we got the hacking, so. Nice, now we can see where the ship fights are. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, attack the Schlever Scum. Now I can hack weapons if I want to. It's missiles I do want. Uh, 
Nice. There's double fire. Darn, he gets through there, doesn't he? Oh, the fire spread, but... Hmm. Oh, he's got a rock. <laughs> of course he does. We're in a rock sector. I saw two humans and a bunch of fires and thought, crew kill. And I was wrong. Sell the weapon. Nothing else makes this a viewership. Might as well be Kestrel D. Well, that's actually the name of the ship is Kestrel D. But I would disagree. Its layout is different than other Kestrel ships. Its coloration is different. Just because I sell a weapon doesn't mean it's all of a sudden not the same ship. Okay. Uh, let's see what our first shot does. And I'm greeting my missiles. I'm gonna greet them. Go hit my weapons. Freaking, but punished, man. game. <sighs> Go F yourself, you piece of effing F. Fucking hell, man. Three fucking times in a row. Bullshit game. Random, everybody. Random. F you. Three missiles to my weapons. Go F yourself, FTL. What's my ship's name? The Theseus? Uh, the Fireball. Look at how random those missile targeting shots were. So random. <sighs> Let's see. I only have five jumps. Okay, I can get to there if I want to. Get it, because ship of Theseus. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't get that at all. Sorry. Am I supposed to understand that reference? Is that a, a the Odyssey reference or something? Uh, was there an FTL ship called the Theseus? There might be one. I don't remember. Good dodges. Saving my scrap because I'm hoping to find a second store. I can't remember. I think Rock is. No, wait, Rock is always two stores, actually. Alright, free Rock crew. That's nice. Um. I'm going to have Rock on piloting, Human on shields, NG on doors, and that's a silly device. Ship of Theseus. There's a game called Ship of Thieves. I don't think that was a Ship of Thieves reference, though, so I'm sorry. It's right over my head. Do you want to go one, two, three, or do you want to check for one, two, store there? Well, either way, I'd go here, right? One, two, three, or one, two, three, yes. We scout out and then get to choose. Best of both worlds. Ah, rock live mine. Red! Nice, we did it! One way would have protected us too. Store, all right, there is our store. I actually didn't think we were going to get a second store. Oh, these weapons are such trash. I mean, Breach 2 is a good weapon, but... It's not really what I'm looking for, man. 
Can I buy it? I guess I can hack piloting breach shields or something. I said before, because you changed a weapon, doesn't make it a new ship. The ship of Theseus was a thought experiment that asked how many planks you could change on a ship before it became a different ship. Wow, I've never heard of that. Okay. Well, that's cool. That was a very involved, deep joke that uh, requires knowledge of something. Is that a physics thought experiment or a an ancient Greek thing with like something Socrates said or something? Emote idea. NG with a halo to represent a run blessed by a silly device. That's cool. I really want, what I would want is an emote that is an NG animated to be manning the doors. Like the door symbol with an NG in there. Although I don't know how you'd put silly device in there. How you'd put, how, how you'd, it would just be the NG, it wouldn't be. I don't know if you could get the word silly device in that little tiny emote. Um. I'm gonna do the weapon value point. It's gonna be expensive to get that. Just a philosophical thought experiment, huh? It's the Beam Master, everybody. Guess we'll go look and see if any fires start for crew kills. That clone bay and a rock, dude. I'd have to use a bunch of bombs to really get a crew kill here. Zoltan or Mantis? I'd rather go to Mantis, but I'd rather have not a Force Zoltan, so... Go Zoltan, I guess. Go Zoltan to avoid a Force Zoltan. Like, circular logic or something. I have long-range scanners, don't I? So I know that that's most likely an empty nebula. It's also a Zoltan nebula, so... That's NG blue, perfect. Six or more, we can get the breach bomb online, although I won't have power for it. It's a very satisfying sound while laser shots smack the ship so close to each other, yeah. Woo! Free scrap recovery arm, okay. Well, I do have home base, so manually search the wreckage is safe. Damn, this is not manually search. Big giant missile. I don't want to do this. Um, if I breach his weapons, I believe that's guaranteed missile offline. God, I don't have enough power, man. I hate this fucking game, man. Fucking hate this game. <sighs> I I probably take a shit ton of damage here. All those weapons, thank God. I have to crew kill to get the better reward. I don't know that I can ever do that though.
Well, if I breach palm it, maybe I do. Okay. So I think he's got... I have a lot of missiles. Let's go for the crew kill here. Let's go for it. It's got to be patient here. And hope he doesn't dodge every other shot. Good. Okay, so it takes two missiles, right? Yes, 45. Yeah, two missiles. Uh, best arm, uh, scrap recovery arm. Best arm for chat to ask how good it is on our hard mode no pause days. And is it worth? Most popular question. Alright, we even, since we did ammunition, we even get our missiles back. Okay. A scrap curvy arm is always worth, that's the answer. Okay, sure. <laughs> Let's see the story. Let's go level two hacking. We have the power for it. If I do that and then see a story, I will feel really bad. But if I see a two shield ship, I might do that. So, hope I don't see instantly see a store after that. Upgrade. <clears throat> that is a. Please don't miss, miss breach bomb. I need to aim there. Damn it, man! Fuck you, FTL. What the hell? Both of my first breach shots have been dodged. I'm, uh, somebody on YouTube once asked, is there a lower accuracy on breach missile or breach bomb? Because it always misses for me. And th it, there's not. But it effing feels like it with the bullshit of FTL. It really does. There is my store. Yeah, we're playing modded FTL. Yeah. What mod? Uh, this mod is from Mr. Keese, and it's a ship pack created by Mr. Keese. Name of it is something. What is it called? Uh, Keese Type DV7. Uh, and there's about like 10 ships in this mod pack or something like that. Okay, he can't damage me as long as I do this, so... The version 27A is the version number of the file. Okay. It's... There's no crazy name for this ship pack. It's just... Keys type something. <laughs> it's named after the creator. The creator has named it after themselves. Who is here in chat. Right there. <laughs> God, these freaking... Dodges and repairs. Six fuel and one drone part. Nope, not good enough. But yeah, on the stream, uh, Deadly V Phantom, we always play ships created by viewers every Monday, so. 
all the ships you'll see today, this is the second run of the day, we'll hopefully get a third one in after this if this one's fast enough, are created by people in chat who have submitted ships for us to play. It's always a fun time. Do I need power? Uh, oh, what am I doing? Just do this. There we go. No more weapons allowed. And your breach, so that's good. How often did you get vented? Um, zero times so far, which I know is not nearly enough. But the run is young. You'll get your venting in, don't worry. So sad that you haven't been vented yet, I know, it's sad. Problem is, you're actually my engine guy, so I don't want to vent you. Silly device. Fair training. Uh, you know what, the shield trained guys are probably who I want to <laughs> vent the most. No nebula for you to explore. Oh, uh, there were some nebula jumps, but uh, we didn't get the manually search the wreckage event, which is what you're probably talking about. I sort of have weapons I can swap out these weird, not great weapons for. No, we do have a backup battery. Okay. That is helpful. And the rest on repairs. Alright, so we need power now, is what we really need. Well, and weapons that I like better. These are really weird weapons we got going on here. Uh, reactor, actually, yes, I will take that, even though that part's so big. Nebula or NG? Um, I don't really have a lot of scrap for NG stores as we find free stuff do I have long range scanners I do right I do all right let's go into the nebula NG nebula suck NGs don't have nebula jumps usually in their sectors rebel civilian Pirate, I think, are the only three that do. Well, apart from Nebula sectors like Slug Nebula and Uncharted Nebula. Attack the ship. Shot here. God damn it. Okay, at least it didn't dodge. I was late on that. Oh god. Oh, good dodge. Okay, just one more missile, please. Ouch. Bomb my dude and it's rude. Bomb my dude, it's rude, don't do it. Long range standards are great. They're my number one augment, although I still haven't watched Crow's video on how to properly scout sectors, aka why long range scanners are garbage or whatever. So I haven't been able to watch that uh, that video. Didn't have time. Oh, you meant I should have chosen NG because nebulas suck. Oh, that's what you meant. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Long range scanners are the best. I agree. 
But there's a video of that Crow Ravel, who is a fairly well-known FTL streamer, put out about how to properly scout sectors. Basically talking about how finding stores is usually the most important thing you want to do in a sector, so you maximize your jumps for doing that. I haven't watched the video, but I, I think I have an idea of what it's about, but I need to, I need to watch it. A dodge. There's a lot of, there's a lot of FTLogy out there. A lot of different in, uh, ideas on strategies and things, and I'm not convinced of that yet, but I also haven't watched the video, so I'm withholding judgment on it, whether I agree or not, since I need to watch the video. Next video, why medbots are the best in a brief two hours. <laughs> I doubt even Crow would make that assertion, but you know, who knows? There's a store. Um, Tech Pirate. Four one power weapons, man. I hate four power. Four one power weapon ships, man. This is so overpowered. I'm hoping it's one. Am I hoping it's one power? I don't know. Double effing missiles are just bullshit. Good. Oh, I hate this game. <laughs> God damn it. Ah, all right. Well, at least it wasn't a missile, I guess, that hit us. Uh, if only medbots would work with Clone Bay, they'd still suck, but it'd at least be an upgrade. How would that work? How would NG medbots even interact with Clone Bay? Oh, fuck you, FTL. God damn it, man. So we had one ship that missiled us three times in the weapons. Now this is one ship that fucking twice in a row ion bombed my weapons. Give me a goddamn break, you piece of shit game. Fucking random. Go after yourself, FTL. Don't you fucking do it three times in a row. Our weapons were ion so long that I think a mantis or something just repaired his fucking weapons in time. So goddamn stupid, man. Fuck you! I fuck this game, man. How did that fucking hit? How do I not have fucking shields online, you shitty ass game? I'm so... This is supposed to be my day when I don't rage at FTL. Wow, that isn't even a two... That is a fucking two damage missile. Beat this shitty game. It's so goddamn stupid. Okay, fuck you, I'm out. Sitting there with my weapons broken while a goddamn Artemis hits us 8,000 times. <sighs> FTL, man. God damn it. I cannot find any weapons in stores. I found nothing but missiles and ions. Shitty run. Ugh. So take mind control, I guess. Drone parts, too. The clone base how power to heal for a small amount per second. That would be too OP, honestly. 
Then it'd have all the positives of Heal Bay and none of the negatives. You just wait every fight. I, why did I? I did not mean to hack that. I meant to hack weapons. Getting all fucking tilted now, man. That deal's bullshit. No fucking dodges. And all of my shots missed. Fuck you, FTL, you piece of shit. Oh man, I'm having a bad time, man. Look at these ships. Double missile. We just fought a four weapon ship with a missile and a bomb into double missiles plus burst laser two. What the F are these ships? These are stupid. These are stupid OP ships that shouldn't exist. Doesn't matter how effing overpowered I am. There's no counter to double missile ships every fucking fight. There's just, there's no counter to that shit. So frustrating to play. <sighs> I don't like the speed laser. I'm sorry, uh, Mr. Keys. I don't like the speed laser. Accuracy is really rough, man. No more stores. I, I think I have to go back to the store and repair again, honestly. Speed laser doesn't like me. Uh, FTL doesn't like me. Just, just give me... Oh, Jesus Christ. Cloaking. Six power and weapons. I'm just gonna, this time I'm going to hack his weapons, not the shields, like a dumbass like I did last time. Have three drone parts left, too. Dodge something that time. Of course, he repaired cloaking the second our ship is about to hit. Why the F wouldn't he? And of course, he's got a value point in shields. Why the F wouldn't he? but not just one. I would take that if it's a two drone part deal. Alright, so my plan was to get two jumps, go to the store, repair again, buy drone parts. Dot, 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 profit? I don't know. I'm uh, not having a good time with these weapons. I need like a free, free flak or something. Free something that's accurate. They're in my sensors. Really? Really, it didn't vent in time? Really? Not 
having a good time this run. FTL just hates me, I guess. I don't know. No, it doesn't hate me. It's just a piece of crap. A piece of crap that cheats. That's all it is. Cheating FTL is cheating. Good scrap gained, at least. Alright, store. I need to repair and buy drone parts. An augment that increases accuracy. I don't know how, how that would work. Well, maybe I'd know how that would work. I wonder if that would be possible. RPG Nerdos, is this, is it possible to design an augment that makes all all weapons remove have uh, all? It would have it would be an augment that made all enemy weapons lose accuracy. That actually probably is possible. Piloting hacking would do a, cer a similar thing. Well, piloting hacking does like these guarantees, but an augment that gives flat cannons more projectiles. Call it the trash compactor. Nice. As far as you know, that's not possible. There are plans to make sensors give counter evasion from what you recall. Okay. Isn't that how cloaking works? Uh, cloaking adds evasion to you. It doesn't remove evasion from enemies. So no, that's not how cloaking works. Might be a proof deal possible here. Uh, let's see if we can go for proof deal here. This. Okay. That should be a crew kill. Get right. I would think it'd be possible to create an augment that removes 10% evasion from every enemy or something, but maybe that's not possible in current hyperspace. I'm not a modder. I'm just a whiner who plays FTL. I'm close to being on the board cloaking, though. I guess I'm saving the scrap right now. Negative cloaking. The opposite of cloaking, yes. You cloak and it makes enemy ships... Unable to dodge your shots. Nice. God damn it. I don't know why the venting is slow so slow. I guess one door is effing slow for venting, I guess, is what's happening. Kill your friends, stupid humans. Kill your, kill your damn friends. Closest you get is having an augment that can trigger every fight to free hack enemy engines and reduce their bars. Interesting. Okay. There's a really good reward. Alright, well we have enough with selling stuff to be able to afford cloaking. So if I can't find a weapon, at least we can improve our defenses if we can find a store with cloaking for sale. Man, I really wanted to like the speed laser, but it's just so slow. Not slow. Uh, just so inaccurate. Oh, this could be really bad if he bombs this guy. Get rid of the dodge with this guy if I can. Oh, 
Okay. Level three piloting running away. Okay. Well, he's never being able, gonna be able to run now, but this could be hard to kill because speed laser is terrible at. being accurate, but it's terrible at. Okay. Big surprise, its weakness makes it really weak at doing certain things. An augment that prevents the enemy from jumping away, but also yourself. Uh, interesting. That would be an interesting, like, risk versus reward augment there. You never have to worry about fleet pursuit doubling again, but if you ever fight a really tough ship, you can't get out. Mort lives somehow, some way, he lives. Alright. Double or Mantis. Are both of those one to two stores? I think they are. Go Mantis in hopes that if that's uh, Zoltan, we can avoid it by going to Slug. All right, any early stores in this Mantis sector? No. Scrap do we have to sell worth of stuff? 35, 25, so 60. 60 scrap worth that we can sell. Forever Rock Quest just chilling by the sun forever. <laughs> yeah, that would actually, that would ruin that, wouldn't it? Two damage missiles, man. Nice. Get that crap out of here. Artemis missile, I think, is the most overpowered enemy weapon in the game. I think it I think it actually is. Fast firing, two damage. Avoids all shields. Can be fought. Anywhere from Sector 1 to Sector 8, I think that might be the single most overpowered weapon in the game for enemies to have. The Artemis Missile Man. Uh, okay, we have 60. Yeah, I can do the shield value. I'm gonna remove all missiles or make it deplete like three or all shield layers. Layers. Uh, yeah, we've we played an augment that removes all missiles. 
Uh, I think the augment's called Rand Hates Missiles or something like that. Created by Math Chimp way back when. Fitting name, yeah. <laughs> hey, thanks for venting yourself. Wait, wait, why'd you stop venting yourself? Please continue venting yourself. Moving all missiles would undoubtedly make FTL easier. What else would you change to compensate to keep the overall difficulty about the same? Oh, I have no idea. I'm not an F I'm not a video game designer or a balance master. I couldn't even begin to speculate on changes that you should make to FTL to make it more balanced. The thing is, FTL is not supposed to be balanced. We've talked to the devs. We all know the devs have given interviews. The game was designed to be punishing, and it does that really well. An augment that disables all enemy missile weapons at the cost of disabling your own hacking. So we can do this because we have clone bay. Beautiful. That is amazing. Free mantis. Store? Still no store. Right, let's get our shield. We have enough to get hacking up. I mean, poking up. Stuff we have to sell. Your win rate is about 7%, huh? I don't know if that's good or bad in FTL, honestly. <laughs> Maybe a bad average. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Guess we'll find out if that's a store too. To make the game more balanced, risks the game losing what it is. On hard mode, perfect play, you probably lose two percent of runs. What even is perfect play, you might ask? I don't know. Probably what Hollow does. Oh, come on, I freaking did that. Why didn't it go off? <sighs> Fuck my life, man. I swear I pressed two and aimed there. I don't know what happened there. But I must not have. If I did, it would have shot that missile down. Took a missile from shitty play. You know what perfect play is not what I'm doing. That's... Uh, if you recall, the developers intended for the average win rate on normal difficulty to be 10%, that's from a dev conference or something. Certain player ships could use a buff, and other enemy ships could perhaps be weaker, like Rebel Disruptors in Sector 1. Now you're talking about to actually balance the game, yeah. Okay. One more jump than the store. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, Bilbo, good luck. Thank you. I'm getting pelted by missiles today, so. Freaking every enemy ship is running. Good dodges, at least. Good dodges for him, too. If I could find a store with non-shitty weapons, that would be a big, you know, be a big help. It's a double fire. On a single fire beam hit. Okay. 
But hey, maybe the fact that I'm finding really terrible stores will mean I'll find really great stores on Hard Mode No Pause Day. You know, I can always hope. All right, I just have to be patient. His weapons and his piloting is breached. I wanted to use another breach bomb, but I'm running out of missiles quickly. Gambler's fallacy is sometimes comforting. It does. It is comforting. Even if it's complete garbo garbajo logic. Good weapons like Vulcan and Firepalm. You know what? I, I think I'd take a Vulcan about right now. Because at least it's accurate. Takes forever to spin up, though, so... The OG speed laser is the Vulcan. <laughs> yeah, it's true. The true speed laser is the Vulcan. Okay. All right, store. Could you please have non-crap weapons? Black ones, burst laser twos, Vulcans, uh, heavy lasers. How about no weapons? Great, thanks, game. Cool. Is there something going on with my RNG that I just are, I'm seeing zero weapons? I want to buy all the drone parts because I'm relying on my hacking right now. It's just crazy, man. crazy I cannot find I think all of my stores have had only missiles and ion missiles bombs and ion weapons I'm pretty sure it's all I've seen at stores is why breach 2 which you know is an awesome weapon is the only thing I have so apart from our starting weapons double bombs and sporting kill your friends Reached his weapons, that's good. Okay. I am bomb on my doors, I'll take that. There wasn't a small bomb on my weapons or something. Uh nine missiles left. Do I go for a crew kill here? Maybe. Oh, he like dodged that. It's crazy. Hmm, okay. Keel base vented, O2 is down. That should be the crew kill. If I'm patient enough. Or use another breach bomb, we'll see. Which I need to do. Does NG fix O2 in time, I guess is the question. Is that where he's gonna go next? I think he is. Alright. One more bomb. <laughs> what was that? He literally dodged. How the hell did a did the AI do that? I have never seen an AI dodge a bomb like that. Can somebody clip that? Somebody clip that. Can somebody clip that NG literally sidestepped my bomb? He fixed the O2. That's what happened. Okay, I didn't even see that. I did not see the O2 get fixed. I. I that looked like that was a player anticipating me bombing him, bomb him, and dodged it. Okay. It's crazy, man. All right, 
Kill your friends. Trying to greed and not use any drone parts. Not working out. Okay, nice fires. My control about to come up. Do this. That did not do what I wanted it to do. I can't spend any more missiles, so we're not going for a crew kill here. When I got scrap, if I can find a store with frickin' weapons, man. I got scrap. I have money, want to buy. Alright, so NG Homeworlds, and these are both full threads after. The slug is two to three stores, NG is three guaranteed, I think. Um slug. No, no, you did clip it. Thank you, uh GM Rock. Yeah, <laughs> he sidestepped that ball. And that's crazy, man. That is crazy. He literally sidestepped it. I right, need level 202 in this sector. Go on doors. Um, do I have long range scanners? do uh, sector six slug. I think they can have four shields. Or probably hack engines breach shields anyway. Just get power. This is the NG in Question. Is that a <laughs> Neo dodging a bullet there? In its current position, three power for speed laser is too much. What would be a better power cost? Well, I don't know if the power is the issue because it's four shots for three power. I honestly don't think that's bad. I think it's the accuracy is the issue. I think it maybe needs to have flak 1 accuracy instead of flak 2 accuracy or something. But then that might be too OP, honestly, so I don't know. Um, Now we could crew kill this, but I'm not patient enough. Or don't have the time today to wait on a, some crew kills. I do want to get a third run in today. Did your clip make it into chat? It did, Jamrock. It did. And it's memes followed what's this reddit one cat on a skateboard doing flips <laughs> okay nice that a, i think that was a cat i was looking for there's another store up there there's not so go here and then down to the store 
Top red is abandoned, bottom red is rock. All right. Double missiles, cloaking, three shields. Oh, I hate this game. Can't. Slugs only have Artemis. So is this a double fucking Artemis missile build? I think it might be. I think this is a double effing Artemis missile build. Stupid and should not fucking exist. Get this game, man. That's so fucking dumb. Remember what I said what the most fucking overpowered weapon in the game is? Hey, how about we give a shit fucking two of them? Fuck you, FTL. This is this is dumb. I'm I'm so salty today. I apologize for how salty I am today. It's just this is really stupid what we're fighting. The amount of Artemis missile ships we're fighting today is just ridiculous. It's literally insane. Put a dollar in the swear jar, I know, I know. I don't want to be using my missiles, because I got... Three left, man. Come on, store. I need any non-missile weapon. I guess I'm probably at the point where I even have to take an eye on if it's offered right now. Which is desperation incarnate. I swear. If I have two runs where I take an eye on Blast 2 today, I'll... Most desperate run of my life, weapon-wise. At least they're not putting the missiles back online, thank god. What do you watch while you work? I watch a guy playing video games. Oh, sounds like fun. It isn't. Feels okay, man. <laughs> it's fun for chat. Not not as much for the guy getting punched in the face. It's like watching YouTube videos where guys are getting, you know, kicked in the dick. <laughs> it's funny when you're not the one receiving the kicks. It's hilarious to watch this person in pain. Weapons. All right, we got a Vulcan, we have stealth weapons, and we have cloaking. All right, what's the what's the play here? What's the play? I think it actually is just Vulcan. Um, do I keep the breach or not? Because if I go Vulcan speed laser, that's a seven power weapons build. Uh, stealth weapons are 50. Second scrap recovery arm, yeah. Um, uh, I mean, I could get this on sooner, but then I'd have no missiles to use it. I'd get this on later. But it cost me... 165 to get online. Sixty five. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to sell a speed laser. I don't even think I'm going to check the second store either. I'm just going to. I mean. Five, six, seven, 
8, 9, 10, 11. Do I stealth weapons? I'd have to sell scrap recovery arm to get stealth weapons. Hmm. Ugh, I don't know. I guess I'm saving up for speed laser, I guess. Vulcan plus speed laser is the lore combo. True, true. I guess we're playing this ship as intended, everybody. Ship as intended, Vulcan speed laser build. Let's go. <laughs> All the fast weapons. Let's let's get let's get this party started. Uh is that, is that slug borders? Free mantis borders. It's free mantis borders, okay. Poke the missile. We have a hundred percent dodge, so that's cool. Make sure you dodge every other shot, please. Oh my God. Okay, there's a fire in the weapons room. That might be a crew kill now. Vulcan crew kill. Who would have thunk it? Vulcan crew killing build. It's the new meta, everybody. The new meta. I get one shot through the and she's dead. There it is. The Vulcan fire killing fire crew killing build meta not recommended oh the ship burned <laughs> it, it burned before the crew died F much as you love scrap army think selling getting stealth weapons with the Vulcan was probably the move it probably was and I was very heavily considering it I could still go back for it, but what I wanted to do was save my scrap to get a second weapon online because um, Vulcan by itself is not good enough. No, I'm not going to go back for it. Disable my doors. Oh. Okay. Um... Okay, this guy's gonna have a hard time burning me out, but he does have three shield, uh, four shields. Pulls grenade pin, throws the last Jedi sucked. <laughs> Is it time? Is it time? Is it Star Wars bashing time? <laughs> Yeah, this guy's got to get really lucky for his weapons to uh, line up. Mary Sue dot dot dot. Um, Catherine Kennedy dot dot dot. Ryan Johnson dot dot dot. I don't know what else to say. We've said everything about it, right? You agree completely, so it's more of a dud. Yeah, I know, right? How can we have an argument when everyone agrees? How can you have a hot take when your take is neither hot nor a take? Did you hear that George Lucas is trying to buy Lucasfilm back from Disney? I heard. I've heard that. Wow. Okay, these dodges are insane. I guess I have to hack a shield. Let's see. Oh, 
charges have been pretty insane. Let's get piloting down now. Getting through four shields with Vulcan is very annoying with dodge. Yes. There we go. Clone Wars is great. Was George Lucas even involved in the Clone Wars, I wonder? Or is that the reason that it was good? Because George Lucas was not involved in it at all. I wonder. There we go. Speed laser build activate. Why well, I need two Vulcans. True. The double Vulcan meme would be the true speed laser full build. Given how damaged the brand is, you bet he'll get a good deal. Uh, I mean, if they're willing to sell... I feel like the problem is, like, Disney probably makes more money off, like, the theme parks and the merch than they ever will off of movies, so why even sell it if they're still, you know, making money off the merch, merch and the theme parks? Fuck you. God damn it. Kill this thing as quickly as we can. Don't you dare get my fucking weapons up, point. Yeah! Eat shit and die, you piece of crap cheating drone. Get wrecked. Get effing wrecked. No ion intruder enjoyed a, a, a drone allowed here. Spawn camped, that's right, get spawn camped. Cheating ass drone. Fucking twice into my weapons. Go F yourself, FTL. Nice, we got it offline. Random twice ion intruder drone into my weapons, by the way. Just gonna throw that out there. We had a fight with two random missiles into weapons. I think three, actually. Then two random ion bombs into weapons. And there's two random ion intruders into my weapons. Can I, can I get some true randomness game instead of the same thing happening every single time? Confirmation bias, Rand. You're only remembering the bad stuff. I know. Still. I'm sure it needs to learn to play. <laughs> oh, my control. It's three borders, this shitty event. All right, his weapons are actually not that bad. Where are his borders? Here. Do I need to hack? Why didn't I counter that? I don't know why I didn't counter that. I think I'd use it offensively, but I couldn't because they were all slugs. Uh, stupid play. Herb stomp that drone. Having the same outcome five times could still be true random. Sorry, you're not helping. <laughs> you're not helping at all. It's not helpful. You're, you're right, but it's not helpful. You're, you're not sticking to the script. You're not advancing my narrative, okay? I'm the victim here, okay? I'm the victim. Please, don't ruin my victimizing of myself narrative. Please. They're in my backup battery. Okay. Support my self-victimizing narrative, please. 
Otherwise, you're banned. Just kidding. Alright, just get rid of the missile. Not allowed. I'm a hit victim held hostage by FTL. That's right. What do I pay you for anyway? <laughs> It's not true random in hard mode because of smart targeting. Yeah, that's true. That's true. There is smart targeting. That is that has been confirmed by testing. Uh, true randomness means it's mathematically possible for you to have an FTL run where none of your shots ever miss. You might have to play the game a few hundred bajillion times, though. All right. Uh, boo -boo -boo -boo. Mantis controlled. All right, at least it's not forced abandon. I'll take it. Quest up there. I have no idea what that quest is, actually. Escort, maybe? I don't know. Okay, do I want to have you kill your friends? Probably not. I'm probably going to have him... Eye on uh, my controller. Oh. Okay, no piloting allowed. Open spun up. Crap, I'm getting hit by a missile, aren't I? Too late, huh? Damn it. This, uh, what's it called? It's good dodge. Weapon, ship, ship collector, ship hunter, whatever. Screw it, just kill him. Just kill him. Ship collectors, annoying. To be honest, you think I picked the worst ship in the pack in terms of fun and interesting gameplay? Really? Well, I was just planning on going in order, like Kestrel, through them. And I disagree. It's got flames on it. And it's a speed laser. Actually, you're probably right. I did see other ones. This is probably the least interesting. But still, we're going to play them all eventually. Might as well do them in order. If I can keep track of things. Do I care about a second Mantis? So what I really care about is level three hacking and power. If you like it, then you better put some bits in it. If you like it, then you better put some bits in it. What? Oh, oh. It is number three in terms of cool looks, though. There you go. I'm very shallow, so I I play things by what looks the coolest. Hey, thanks for the hundred bits, Hodrak. You bought a new car. Grats. What kind of cards you get? Tell us about your new car. Tell us about this car. power. Okay. We did have enough dodges, thankfully. Still down, please. Perfect. Um, a BMW one. Got a Beamer, huh? I don't. I don't know if I know what the one is. When I was 
in high school, I thought the coolest car was the BMW Z3 because that's what James Bond drove in Goldeneye, Tomorrow Never Dies. I forget which one. I don't know if I know the BMW one, but congrats on your new car. I bet it's super nice. Chat, let's talk politics. I just nuked the Romans and the Aztecs in Civ 3 because they were a bunch of a-holes and deserved it. This is this is allowed. I will allow this kind of political talk. Let's get doors. We're in a we're in a mantis sector. Should have got those earlier. BMW one. BMW one is uncommon in the US. Okay. Was it Goldeneye? Okay, yes. Am I happy with the Vulcan gaming? Yeah. Yeah. I like Vulcan. Vulcan cloaking hacking. It's good. I'd rather have this build than Ion Blast Mark II plus anything, I guess. Gandhi tried to nuke you once. Let the let the hate flow through you. BM1 Series 118i Sport Line, to be more precise. Cool. If you got a picture, feel free to link it. I'll check it out. I think the US starts with the BMW 3 Series. They had the one here for a little while, but it didn't sell well. Okay. That's double missiles. I got a missiles, I just have to. I don't want my weapons guy to be in there. I did not mean to do that. Nice missile down. Thanks for proceeding directly to the venting room. That could be a crew kill here. Uh, whoops. Sadly, there is no longer a crew kill here. Uh, you did want to point out the cool piston action that you animated on the back of the speed laser. Oh, I need to look at that. I did notice there was a little extra thing behind it. I did not realize that it was... Doing like the flak piston thing. I need to check that out. Thank you for uh, pointing that out. Do we have uh, six? Someone noticed that earlier. Oh, I must have missed that. You guys start with the two series now. No one series in the U.S. Best part of the ship is that the little piston, eh? A single missile with 8,000 value points. How do I take this offline? I guess I just hack the missiles. I guess I just hack them. This is all I can do. You know what? I'm going to hack the missiles. I'm going to... Missile maneuver it. Okay. Why did you go into the other room, damn it? Oh, whatever. Not only did the engine not attack the weapons, he went out and then came back in and started repairing them after the mind control wore off. Nice. No, no more missiles for you. Get wrecked. Let's let's check out this animation here. Yeah, that's cool. Very cool. I like it. Looks great. Well done on that, Mr. Keys. Uh, NGs are smart today. Yeah, they're dodging my missiles and. Counteracting my mind control strats. Too OP, these NGs. 
Remember Rand saying how he would find a weapon between Burst Laser 2 and Burst Laser 3 cool with 4 shots for 16 seconds? Now we got 4 shots for 8 seconds. That's already double from what would be not OP. Yeah. Yeah, that is... The Speed Laser is... I like the stats on it except for the inaccuracy. And the... The inaccuracy is far more pronounced than it would be with other inaccurate weapons because of what because of how inaccurate it is i guess i'm pretty sure that's a bigger radius than flak too and that's why it's been tough to fight some of these ships with this weapon he never specified he wanted the lasers to hit <laughs> okay guess i have to be more specific of my future comments on what would be cool for weapons, huh? I think it's the same radius. It's three pixels smaller than Flak 2. Okay. Three pixels smaller, but also three projectiles fewer. Alright. Gauge the pirate. The best thing to do is crew kill. And oh my god, that's double ion plus glaive beam. Oh my god. Um, okay. This time this should work, right? Yes. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna let this eye on fire, cloak it, hack. I should give our shields plenty of time to recharge while our Vulcan spins up. Oh, we actually got his cloaking down with a random missed speed laser shot. Well done, inaccurate speed laser. Beautiful. Although we are susceptible to damage still. Nope, we're good. All right, uh, let the pirate escape and do this. That's the best scrap game for that. Projectiles themselves of flax are bigger, so they hit easier than those slim burst laser tooth shots. That's why so many... Shots miss rooms. Is that really true? Do flak projectile sizes matter for them hitting rooms? That I didn't know. There's a good weapon. Problem is, I can't... That's seven weapon power. Buying a flak would put me up to nine. But I'd have to either stop using speed laser to use hack, a flak, or I'd have to stop using a Vulcan. Damn, I think we have to keep the meme build, don't we? The only weapon I could get that would be usable with this is a stun bomb. Wow. Um, I think we have to keep the meme build. I think every flak projectile is the same size for the game. That only the center point of the hitbox had to be inside the room. I, I don't know. That's... Y'all might know better than me. Y'all. If I'm firing at shields, get fire chance. Stun them in the fire. You know what? I just did it. I bought a stun bomb, everybody. I bought a stun bomb. Is there any uh, stealth weapons in this store? There's not. Okay. I bought a stun bomb. Let's go for some weird, really weird meme build here. Full meme tastic build. What do you mean, don't ever go full meme? We always go full meme. Okay. Uh, just different UIs and extra flak projectiles that are there for looking good. From your experience digging through game files, there's three sets of sprites for flak projectiles. Large and medium are used for damage, and smaller used for the fake shots. Interesting. I did not know that. 
Large and medium only have a difference in appearing or also difference in interaction with hitting a room? Good question. There's a store. Good one power weapon? No one power weapons. Okay, I'm going to not buy a crew because I'm hoping to get stun bomb and force shield up, potentially. Golden shields will be gone guaranteed by the time stun bomb is up, you think? I don't know about guaranteed. Maybe for the second stun bomb shot. Interesting layout. Okay, let's go ahead and get the stun bomb up first. Where's Pie Boy? Pie Boy loves stun bomb. Or he loves to meme about loving the stun bomb. Oh yeah, he was here earlier, so we can we can tell him all about it. Uh freaking rebel disruptor. Couple bombs. Okay. Alright, they're not ion bombs. I can tell by the I think that's double small bomb. Yeah. Oh man. Double stun bomb, that's actually not stun. Double small bomb is actually pretty scary. Uh, I need to get you out of this room. We're going to need you to repair stuff, most likely. Okay. Okay. Stun bomb the repair drone. So OP, that stun bomb, man. Look how OP. I can't believe you passed on that flak. Hashtag not my rand. I mean, we gotta go with the speed lasers. Sorry. Go speed laser. Go, go speed laser. Or however the speed racer song goes. With flak, you have three dots light up where the flak is going to hit. Those three dots are all the same size. True. Rand using a Vulcan. Yes. We have the speed laser build going on here. I don't want to hack your missile. I don't want to, but I'm going to. Hook the first one. Speaking of Vulcan. That's dead human. Uh, it's not a bad deal, but no, we want scrap. Vulcan showdown. Vulcan v Vulcan. Who will win? Uh, there's our shield value. Probably get fourth shield, but not on my other value points based on how much scrap I'm thinking we're getting here. Julian Verse would love this build. <laughs> I don't know. Julian Verse is all about the chain laser, not the Vulcan. Vulcan is like a, a, a bad chain laser or something, according to Julian Verse, as far as I remember. I feel like I might need to, you know, and I think I do need to hack the weapons. Because Vulcan's gonna fully spin up. And only my Vulcan's allowed to fully, fully spin up the game. Wow, those are some insane dodges. Okay, there we go. Vulcan down. Vulcan down, Vulcan down! Do, 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 do. 
Just moved over your computer so you can play FTL on your iPad. <laughs> Are you going to do hard mode no pause on iPad? I remember somebody one time told us in chat they were doing that. Was that you or was that somebody else? But Vulcan is a bigger Vulcan is a bigger chain laser and bigger is always better, right? I don't know. I'll have to ask Julian verse. I don't know. Weird love, weird relationship between Julian verse and the chain laser. You love how Flak 2 is better than Flak 1. Are you trying to start a like a like a, a war? Just about lies like that? Horrible, ridiculous, misleading lies. I'm gonna hack your cloaking, because I'm just ugh, cloaking is a pretty hard counter to Vulcan, I feel like. Dodge. No way you're doing no pause. You're not good enough to do a hard no pause. You're still trying to win them all on medium. Okay, nice. Your favorite meme run of all time was when you got double breach two bomb with explosive replicator and turned the flagship into Swiss cheese. Nice. Uh, you remember stalling phase three so you could get a breach on every tile on the ship. Time to spread misfortune on the misinformation on the internet. I'm pretty sure it's always time for that, right? I think it's always time for that. That's every day on the internet. But if it's on the internet, it must be true. On the internet, on the internet, on the internet. Why Romulans use cloaks? Hard counter to Vulcans. Ho! <laughs> well played, well played. I get it. Star Wars joke. Or meme or something. Man, I don't know if I'm going to be able to play the ship I was planning on playing third, because I don't know if it's going to be strong enough to end early. Okay, we got to hack this four shield. Really? This is an effectively, this is effective five shield ship right here. Right, so once it's fully charged. Oh, but he can't get through our shields. Ah, uh, that's fine. And I do this to speed up the fight then. Was that your ship? Well, I was plan I was thinking of replaying your ship. Um, Void Master. I'm the one that we played the OP version. What is it called? I'm, I'm unsure. I might look at it. Cause I'm unsure of how difficult it's gonna be. Cause if it's gonna be an over two hour long run, I don't think I'll have time to do that. Cause I have a, I have a gig I gotta get to. Yeah, the Sentinel. That's the one. Okay, so that's our last value point there. And then, oh my, uh, backup battery. Actually, do backup battery maybe. That will get back a battery value before phase two, I think. All right. Not too strong, but the other ship you sent is pretty strong, you think? The Infinitum? Okay, I might put off the Sentinel for another week again. Sorry to say, just because I don't... I, I gotta be... I gotta be... I have a call time of 5.30. Which means I need to leave by 5, which means I need to end the stream by like 4.30 if I can. If I can. Yeah, that's a good hack. Yeah, cutting it close. That's why if I can do an hour and a half to hour and a 45 minute run, that would be ideal. I can delay. Just slow down this a bit. And I might need something small. Time is it for me? 2.51. Whew! That stun bomb delayed it just long enough for me to... And my cloak didn't go off. Okay. 
I don't know why my cloak, cloak just didn't happen there, but whatever. Maybe it had something to do with the... something, I don't know. It's gonna get deleted, I'm not sure why I did that, it's fine. That's what I was say. Okay, let's see what we got here. If I can stun bomb in this fire, let's see if stun bomb is the most OP thing ever. I don't know if they dodge it, that's for sure. And so close to a bunch of extra crew kills. All right, finish him. This day the opera? No, the opera was on Saturday. Today is North Texas annual concert co conference for Methodist ordination or something. It's part of my church job. We're going to sing at a church while they ordain new ministers, and we're singing inspirational church music. <laughs> well. Opera went really well. Um, we had a good crowd. I am pretty much got all my words right. The music went well. If I weren't so underpaid, I would be ecstatic about how it went, but I'm actually just kind of pissed off that I did so much work and got paid so little, to be honest. I found out how may how much some of the other singers made and I got completely completely cheated. So I'm probably not going to do anything with that company ever again. Or at least not any offers with that company ever again. This Yeah. Yeah, the guy who played the lead role uh who played Figaro who is the, you know, title character in Marriage of Figaro, uh, was paid 500 I was paid 150 so less than a third what he was paid. And I definitely didn't do a third of the work that he did. It's just, just one of those things. The lady who runs this thing is kind of... I think she's just kind of taking advantage of singers, young singers. I'm not that young, but there are a lot of young singers that sing with the group, and I think it's just, she's just underpaying everybody. Counter them on the price next time they ask. Uh, I'm, I actually wrote out a very, uh, trying to be respectful, but also scathing email that I'm just debating if I send it or not saying that if they want to hire professional singers, they have to pay professional prices. Otherwise, they're going to get amateur singers and not have good shows. But I don't I don't know if I'm going to send it yet or not. I, I sent I sent a potential to a friend of mine who I sing with to get her to get her feedback before I send it, because I don't I don't want to alienate other people unless um, it'll actually make any changes for the positive. So I'm going to get somebody's feedback before I do it. Most valuable business skill you've yet learned how to write an email that dresses down in an a-hole without it directly looking like you're dressing down the a-hole? Yeah. Skill that I probably do not have yet. Best way to handle that is to find evidence from the other covenant companies and see what they're offering to pay for professional singers and send that evidence. I don't know that that would work in this case because this is a religious group that um, is technically not a professional opera company. So it's hard to compare them to say Dallas Opera or something when they're a very small, not professional company. They might even, I don't know if they're even considered like a not-for-profit group or something, you know? It's, it's hard to, I feel like it's hard to prove stuff like that.
The name of the company is called Music Ministry something. I'm not going to say anymore just because I don't want to cause some huge like flame war online or something. But Ministry is in the name of their um, company title. So I think they're considered a religious group. All right, GG. GG cookie time. The... Uh, I need to keep track of these. The Kestrel version of the, the Fireball of Keese's type ship pack thing. So we'll keep track of this. That is the Fireball. Cool ship. We played it full as intended speed mo speed run mode. So there we go. Quickly check that score. We broke 6k. Nice. All right, can't read the um, wall of text right now, Jacob Cheese. Okay, Jacob Cheese. All right, really quickly, I need to stand up, should I choose restroom? Quickly take my final break. When we come back, we will do one more ship and try to speed run it. We'll see which one is the strongest and choose that. So be back just a bit, my friends. Y'all rock. <laughs> 